Hey there YouTube, today I want to show you guys how to make a restore point. Uh, you're probably wondering first of all why I'm recording such a small part of my screen. Well I have school now and I'm not going to have a lot of time to edit. So I just won't edit at all. I'm going to get started on my homework and hopefully make two tutorials today. I'm hoping, I don't know if I will. So yeah. Um, also the first thing you'll notice is that my desktop, I am using my uh, computer without the recycling bin anywhere. Uh, if you guys want to know how to do that, go ahead and search up my video. Uh, it should be the one right before this. How to hide your uh, recycling bin. Whatever. Okay. <clears throat> the only folder I have is my master folder. It has everything I need in it. I, I like to keep it out there, even though I have it on my rocket dock, whatever. Okay. If my voice gets all crazy, like, uh, well, then it it's because I'm not, my voice is crappy today. It's been like that all day. I don't know. I think I need to eat. I think I have anxiety or something. Well, anyway, <clears throat> here's my rocket dock. If you want to learn how to get that, what's this? What is that? If you want to learn how to get this, go to www.rocketdock.com. Well, that's where to get it. And to find out a video on it, there's plenty of videos out there. Go ahead and search it up, rocketdock.com. I mean, rocket dock. Gosh, I can't get. <laughs> okay. All descriptions and links will be on the side, so I'll have rocketdoc.com on the side, and I'll have the link to my uh, how to hide the recycling bin video and so on. Okay, also something that I want to do, and I I would really appreciate it if all the other um, tutorial makers left this for me, because I, I really want to make this video. It's just something I really want to do, so please just let me do it. Okay, what it is is how to change your start button title, how to change the text on it. Uh, I, I just learned it. Yes, I just learned it, so whatever, you can call me a noob, call me whatever, but uh, yeah, I learned how to do it, and yeah. So in that video, you're going to have to make your store point, okay? And today I'm going to show you how to do that, that way you'll have some experience already. Okay, what you want to do is go to Start, All Programs, go up to Accessories. Next, you go down to System Tools. And next, oh, by the way, it's really good to back up your your stuff. Really good to disc clean up your stuff, disc defragmenter, um, all that stuff. And it's really good to make a system restore. Okay, so just this is all your system tools. Use it. Okay. Use it. Okay. So we're gonna click on system restore today. Let's click that. Okay. So welcome to system restore. To begin, select the task that you want to perform. We have 1. Restore my computer to an earlier time. B. Create a restore point. Or C. Undo my last restoration. Restoration. Whatever. Okay. <clears throat> Let's say you don't know if this program that you're about to download will give you any viruses, any spyware, or anything. This is not guaranteed to help, but it helps a great deal. Okay? Like, 95% or like 80% of the time, no, 95% of the time it will help. Okay, this what it does is when you create a restore point, let's click that uh, restore point description, let's name it a video restore for sure. For sure, okay, make the, the restore point description very detailed. Well, anyways, what this does is it looks at everything. Okay, and it's it's really fast actually to be doing this. It looks at everything, like all the main files and stuff. And usually, when you get a virus or something, or something goes wrong, what the virus will do, or what the spyware will do, is it, it, it attaches to a main file, somewhere where you can't get rid of it, right? And that's how you get all these pop-ups and everything, because you just don't know how to get rid of it. Sometimes your spyware blocker doesn't pick it up, whatever. Well, if everything if everything else fails go make a restore point well you're gonna have to go back to the restore point you made so this could create here so I can show you what I'm talking about <laughs> wow okay and, and it'll take everything back to the way it was there you go new restore point made let's go to close okay I already actually have it on my start right here so go to accessories system tools you know the whole bit Let's just store my computer to an earlier time. Ah, uh, there goes my voice. Okay, here's the 8th of January. Oh, come on, my voice. Okay, 
Okay, guys, I'm gonna talk like this. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, it's the 8th of January, and this is the time I made it. Like 5:32 and 18 seconds. Look what time it is. 5:32. Okay. Um, video restore for sure. Click next. Follow through it. It will restore your computer to how it was when I made that restore point at that time. Right now, my computer is running fine. So if I ever, ever, ever needed to go back and uh, you know put my computer the way it was there you go you just click that but 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 an, an important factor is that most all the programs that you've installed from that time will all be gone let's say you like did a crazy video you have made like five tutorials and that are like ten minutes long each okay and you made a system restore before that Actually, yeah, the programs. What am I talking about? Let's say you installed Rocky Doc. Rocky Doc, before you, uh, before installing Rocky Doc, you made a system restore point. Let's say something went wrong with a different program that you got after you got Rocky Doc. You do the system restore that you made before Rocky Doc. <laughs> Rocky Doc will be gone if you go through with that restore point. That's just what I'm saying. You'll, you'll, there's a chance of losing files. But it's better than having to reinstall the operating system. If if restore point if restore system restore fails, and uh, <clears throat> yeah, if it fails, then sorry, you're on your own. I don't know. I wouldn't know what to do. Uh, I personally would reinstall my operating system. So that that's the last resort, though. Remember, if you reinstall your operating system, you lose everything. Oh, you don't want that to happen, do you? So just be careful with what you do. How many minutes am I at? I'm at 6.55. Well, guys, this is how to make a system restore. Hope this has helped you. Uh, look forward to my next videos coming up. Also, don't forget to subscribe to Amped Fear. His link will be on the side of my video. Thanks.